Welcome to this episode where we check out Peter Island and the Willie T. In our last episode, we had a beautiful sail all the way from Anagata down to Cooper Island. Lauren and Austin went scuba diving and came back engaged. We had reason to celebrate and went into the Cooper Island Beach Club for dinner. Our week on the boat was coming to an end, so we decided to head to Peter Island for our final night. check that out. Willie T, as you know, is a floating bar and restaurant. It was in Norman Island, but they kind of chased them out of there after the hurricane, and they're back now in uh, Peter Island, so we're going to check that out. We'll be down there about five miles, just about an hour trip, and uh, we're coming around the corner right up here is the, uh, the bay, so not too much sailing today, just kind of out <laughs> motor sailing around, and uh, actually just motoring around. I've never seen uh, this calm out here in the Sir Francis Drake Channel. We have uh, Tortola over here on the on the right, on the north of us, and uh, just nicely making way this morning. Frigate okay, Beach is up in here, and then the uh, the Willie T is actually up on the end of the bay here. And okay, there's several mooring balls either side of it, so you can pick up a ball either side. Nice. I think you'll. I think this will do for today. Yeah. Here you see us approach the mooring from downwind. Lauren and Parker each have a line tied to the bow of the boat. Austin will then reach down and pick up the pendant with the boat hook and both Lauren and Parker will string the lines through the pendant and then back to the bow of the boat. These two lines create what we call a bridle and it keeps the boat from swinging side to side. By the end of the week, these guys had that procedure down pretty well. Famous Willie T. We're almost too close if they can party all night. What do you think, guys? We didn't get Peter Island. You digging it? Woo.
waters around Peter Island were crystal clear and there was also abundance of sea life, including this lobster. We saw two of these creatures while snorkeling. This one was about a foot long, just crawling along the bottom. This is only the second time I've ever seen squid while snorkeling. I swam with these guys for a few minutes until I spooked them and they swam away. After snorkeling, Ginny, Lauren, and I took the dinghy over to the Willie T to check it out. If you're not familiar with the Willie T, it was the original floating bar here in the BVI. Of course, Hurricane Irma ended up destroying that in the, in the big storm and hurricane. And uh, they built a new one and Norman Island would not take it back. So they decided to put it here in Peter Island. Every single day, yeah, not having too many worries. You know, wake up when you want to wake up, yeah. eat what you want to eat, drink what you want to drink. <laughs> there you go. All in all, enjoyed the trip. Got to meet a couple new people that I haven't had a lot of time with. That's right. That's right. Loved being here. Glad I'm here. And now I'm engaged. <laughs> That was a kind of a highlight. Yeah, let's talk let's talk about that highlight, huh? What do you think? I have had a fabulous time. Have you? I've, awesome. The weather's been beautiful, the boat's great, the yeah. company is stupendous. Couldn't it be better. <laughs> oh, okay. To be a part of the right. engagement was Wasn't that fabulous. Exciting? Yeah, it was fun. And I've just had so much fun with everybody. What are you gonna say? Yeah, well, I was sleeping in the galley this trip. That was, <laughs> yeah. was kind of new, but it was, you know, I, I didn't get quite as much sleep as I would have liked, but yeah, uh, I still had, you know, I, I finished my book and uh, got to spend enough time in the in the heat. It was good. Yeah. And, yeah. No, you have just these, you have just these few years with these kids, and then right. they're off, then they're off having their own families, right. having their own their own careers or whatever. Exactly. And uh, they're gone. Yes. So I, I'm just so blessed. I'm so blessed. I feel this week to have them along. I really am. I know. And, uh, and love you all. And Jody, you, you, you've been a trooper. You, you organized all the cooking, all the, all the provisioning. You know, like we couldn't have done this without you. And you've done it before, but you know, again, I, I was on my own as a skipper, and you were on the, your own as, as kind of run the, run the show and, and, and you know, with all the food and the beverage and everything. So. It's a hell of a lot I of think work. we did a good job. We did. I think we did you know, a hell of a I, good did, job. Did we like drink our last beer right here? Yeah, <laughs> you know, we don't I have think, too uh, much left over. This would be it. I think we're just about and I'm beer. drinking it. We got a little <laughs> bit of rum, a little bit of gin, so we did really good, guys. No, the gin is gone. Yeah. You know, we're, we're going to plan trips in the future, so 
we're going to share with more people. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. And, uh, I know. Yeah, and we love it. Okay. That's all I got. Thank you guys. <laughs> Cheers to what we have left. Cheers. 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 Well, that was our last night in the boat. We got a little nostalgic and talked about the trip and what a great time we all had. Next morning, we headed back to the island of Tortola to turn the boat in. We first had to stop by an Andy Key for fuel. We got the boat fueled up and then we returned to uh, the TMM charter base back in Roadtown. As always, we have a couple days after the charter to actually rest up from our vacation. So uh, we took a couple days and sat around the pool and did a little more touring of the island and just had a great time. Austin and Lauren left and Jeannie and Sue left and Parker ended up leaving too. And it was just Jody and I for the last couple days, but really had a fantastic time and just another great charter experience with uh, TMM and the BVI. This is our last video in our British Virgin Island sailing series. I hope you uh, enjoyed it as much as we did. And uh, make sure to stay tuned. We're going to be uh, traveling to the BVI again in uh, January of 2020. So there'll be more videos coming your way. Mm -hmm.